कोमरा नमस्कार दिस इज इंटरनेशनल मास्टर एंड फिडे सीनियर ट्रेनर शेखर साहू वेलकम टू यू ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स अथॉरिटी गुजरात गुजरात स्टेट चेस एसोसिएशन टू दिस इंटरमीडिएट ट्रेनिंग सेशन सो एज आई टोल्ड यू आई विल बी स्टार्टिंग सिसिलियन ड्रैगन मेनली फॉर वाइट पीसेस हाउ टू किल द सिसिलियन ड्रैगन for quite long time the sicilian dragon was quite popular till 1978 when carpo had a stunning victory over portnoy in only some 24 moves portnoy blamed it was whole game was home preparation even then it was very good and then improvement started for both side for white black on various patterns and as of today white stands better theoretically and it is important that white player must know the correct theory otherwise sicilian dragon is very dangerous so let's have a look at uh, various uh, diagrams that i am going to discuss hello clara and tanmay azmera ramakrishna akshar jhala and krishav sa all are welcome to start with i will show the game carpo postnai because it played a very important role In the candidates final, the winner of the match would go to meet Fisher. I mean, not Fisher. It is, uh, it is. Twenty-four. Uh, yeah, the winner of the match will go to play Fisher in the World Championship. So this is the starting point of yours, lad. Now, if Black wants to prepare castle, that is known as classical. After the move B E two, G six castle, castle. Now B E three, N C six, Knight B three. This is a threat now. This is a threat now. So Knight B three, and he can play Knight A five, or he can play Bishop B six, then Queen C eight, and Rook B eight, and then D five. This is the idea. Tata or various, and what will pay a four, a five, and etc. But until and unless the player goes for Yugoslav attack, dragon has little to fear. Sicilian dragon, you cannot tame the dragon without beating it direct from the frontal attack. Take the bull by the horn. So Yugoslav attack is the best. Yugoslav attack starts with bishop e3. Now the point is that black cannot harass the bishop. This will be lose tactically because of a check. Now this will lose a piece. This will lose exchange. Also losing. So here it is important that you must make a room for the king first. Now this is a real threat because king has a room. so you have to stop it playing f3 it is not good idea to play bishop e2 because if bishop is needed to stay at c4 it is required bishop's presence at c4 to stop d5 so f3 will do the job controlling the knight so that queen is free now now the queen is free and then sorry the queen is free and then you will castle now You can go knight c six castle. Now we sub c four. I will not discuss this knight uh, nine d four because uh, this is slight better for white, but is not enough. So let me only discuss we sub c four. There are various moves here. I mean, black can prepare to play. Knight b6, knight b6, and knight b6, and then come to attack the bishop, and then one of the knight will come, and then 
to take the bishop. So, this is one plan. The other plan is to play bishop d7, rook c8. The other plan is to play bishop d7, followed by rook c8, and then go for the attack. So, here I will discuss the theoretical diagrams. First, see this bishop d7. Here, I recommend to players to clarify. There are two types of things that can happen. One of the main plan of Yugoslav attack is to play h4, h5, and then take the pawn, and then bring the bishop and exchange. And after that, we will continue to attack. So, in the meanwhile, black can do counter attack by bringing the rook here, in the, getting a tempo and on this line, and then he will try to get counter attack with knight e5. Even here, there is a move called Chinese dragon. That also I will discuss. So after bishop d7, the game continued h4. I recommend to play h4. Now we'll castle, but what there is no hurry. This black need to clarify. What black wants? He should if he will he allow this h5 and take the pawn and attack. So he can play either h5 trying to slow down white's attack. He will play h5 to slow down white attack or he will ignore the h5 move and come root down to put pressure. So this is an important cross move. h4. Now in the game, Borsumai played counter attack. Now bishop c4 is unprotected. Knight e5. Oh, castle. You have to take it. Now I will also discuss now in the variation to play rook e8. The reason is why rook e8 sometimes because the, when the bishop comes you cannot save the bishop. You will take the rook. So sometimes rook e8 is the improvement. I will discuss that later. First let us see knight c Karpo Korsnoi game. Hello, Devang Makwana. Yes, Ramakrishna. You know this game, but I am going to discuss a lot of variations on Dragon. This is just a model game. So, it is not the theory where white and black has both improved in the variation. I will discuss. Here, Rook takes H5. Now, Black attack is slow because white is already there. He will open up the line. He will open the line. And exchange. Before. Okay. The idea, idea that uh, immediately this fails. This fails. Because in the both rook and bishop are focusing on this. So, immediately this does not work. Knight into e4 will come. And the reason that uh, here there is also possibility an exchange sack comes. Or often black gives an exchange sacrifice. So, white stops the plan. Now, he is ready. He is free to go without the fear of rook into c3. Now, bishop takes. So, black is all set. To give the exchange sacrifice also. White uh, has to play very carefully. White plays here. Rook d5. What else? The point is if you play g5, knight h5, and there is no attack coming. Rook into pawn into. Now, here, rook into pawn check. See that it is now, it is very slow. There is a threat here. There is a threat here. But check. Now it is not easy. It is not easy now. This is the problem. Now you are, if, the, if you play mechanically, 
some queen move, knight check is coming. So this is the problem is coming. The check is coming. And then queen coming there to g7. So everything changes. That is why you have to be very careful that one should not mechanically go for attack. The counter attack rook into g2 comes. So here so g5 is not good because of this variation. And here if you play rook d5 idea that push the queen away now rook c5 comes. No more attack. Now black has got counter attack. Uh, two, two, uh, I mean, he has got uh, for the exchange. He has got uh, two pawns, and not and not enough uh, attack is there. This is not good. So let us say the correct move played by Karpo. Home prepares the team. Karpo team prepared a fantastic novelty. In the position, instead of playing either g5 or rook d5, d5, he plays rook d3. Overprotecting. Now there is black must do something because white attack anyway coming. So he played this idea. Now the same g5 will continue. Now the same g5 attack will continue. So he stopped g5. Anyway, g5. Anyway, g5. So you have to take it. Knight cannot move. If knight moves, then I think uh, now the same variation he can play now rook d5. Knight cannot take. There is a mate in 3. 1. To queen, to queen check, queen check, mate. If you take mate in 2. And rook takes also not working. Knight in 2 and you cannot take the knight. So this is also he plays rook in two. Now there is a problem. You cannot take the knight mate in two. Now white is simply threatening knight into pawn check, knight into knight check also. So he plays rook. The idea now black will escape knight into pawn into. When you give a check, king will escape. King will escape. But here white again played a fantastic move. It is very difficult to find a series of correct moves. Unless it is home preference. So he finds another lovely idea. He wants to take knight into knight. When pawn into knight is played, after pawn into knight, the knight will enter, controlling the square all over. That means he has to surrender the queen. No, no choice. Knight on f6 and knight d5. Cutting off the black king from the flight square is sir. King jo bhag raha hai, to knight bar ke aja hai. So, only move. Idea stopping second knight d5. This is another fantastic move. The whole point is you have to take, there is no choice. Knight cannot move, pawn cannot take. Suppose you now, there is no other, no other move. I don't see, I don't see he can defend. For example, now pawn takes pawn loses. Pawn takes pawn loses to knight into knight, pawn into knight, and knight h5. And takes, there is a checkmate. But so he cannot take the pawn and he cannot take knight into knight, only pawn into now check and now knight queen check. He, he resigns because after uh, king comes here, knight check. That will because rook check I cannot give, so deflect the queen. Knight check and rook check, and it is all over. Actually, it, oh, um, I knew you saw the game. And I was going to say that in the morning, a very good model example I am seeing in the fifth, sixth time or more. Okay. Okay, good afternoon, everybody. Now, let me tell you this is improvements in the game, variations. It is not that everything is now so easy. Black found improvement, then white found improvement. Not many games played in the line in this area. So it is here on h4, rook c8. 
at c4, click, click. Now h5. Here, instead of playing queen f5, Mark tried to improve with rook e8. Now, Look here, let us see some games now. Everything, whole thing changes. On this move, he will run away, bishop exchange. So, bishop exchange is not forced. So, here, for example, I will show you, those players did not prepare just by seeing that Karpov Korsunai game, they come and play, they will have problem now. But still, white has attacked, but let us see how black players mishandled. Now, Hearthstone beats Sosonko. Sosonko is a very strong grandmaster, used to play only dragon. Free attack. What else? Now anyway he is coming, then queen f5 coming, rook double, now if pawn pulls white, black attack is getting dangerous, the bishop is alive, bishop is dangerous. Pressure is coming now on c3, indirectly the bishop on h8 also, forced, the knight a4 and all is very bad, so only correct move. This is, I think black has, uh, I think uh, here, he plays this move. And I think it is all over. So here, BB2 he came. I think he cannot take, he cannot take that. He cannot accept it. After queen checks, he cannot go because of bishop uh, knight into knight and bishop d bishop b4. It should win the game. He should lose, I think. Yes. You have to see very carefully. Queen takes pawn should win. This should win. Because no square and here also there is a problem. So it is it is difficult. You will lose further and further material. Okay. Now you can play BB5. I want to hit here. Queen D3 check. It is dangerous. So here you can't accept it. And bishop B2 will lose the bishop. After knight into and rook c8. Knight into d5 and rook c8. Finishing. So he cannot do. So in that game, he plays. Black has got enough compensation. All five pieces are in attack. Now also black has got more material plus attack. Endgame is winning if he exchanges queen. It should, be, it should be over. Either he loses queen or he will be in great danger. So, here this is what happened that people saw the Karpo Korsunai game and they start playing without realizing. Now, this is improvement here. Let me show you another two wins for black, then how white improved. So, the Karpo was in 74, then this was Tan Lian and Singapore IM versus uh, Grandmaster and making from Brazil. So, this was a substantial improvement, RE8.
you you have to do something you know is is giving a pressure one two giving pressure already these are bad things if you play anyway b5 b4 will come so to close the diagonal this is necessary unexpected because he is getting a piece any anyway the piece is getting so unexpected so he survives but lost anyway it is bad now my bishop cannot move the knight is falling so bad push that threat is coming still anyway the simple threat is rook c so anyway one of the rook is lost and attack continues so this becomes dangerous one more game also i will show you that is also it is important to know there is a danger let, let us see the modern things who is this grand master nikolai nikolai versus kirill georgiev who is a very well prepared player kirill georgiev so white found an improvement e5 now this i will tell you there is improvement of our white will after e5 that need not take it after you take you lose the piece because g5 and d7 will fall after you take this g5 and the d7 bishop will is lost so it he gives the piece this way knight into pawn into a bishop now if you can see that it is uh, the material factor that black is a little ahead than white both have got i think no it is a piece for how many pawns 3 5 7 pawn 4 pawn 3 pawns it is not bad and still weaknesses and he has to organize an attack which is not easy for white it is bad position now now rook and rook will invite the bishop and the king the another pawn four pawns for the piece is too much black is ahead now winning the game but let us see i will tell you what is the improvement you need not mechanically take here when you play ng4 you need not play, need not mechanically take what is the question Yes, the carpo course in a game I am discussing. Hello, Mukund Agarwal. <laughs> okay, Virabhadra. Now look here. There are improvements for white. I will show. A substantial improvement after the move B H six. This is this is he he played this this is badly played by uh, I mean back. And White went on to win, but this is not that thing. I will show the more modern game: Nisi Piano versus Colas. no this is here 
this one is improvement here improvement is queen e1 i like this improvement queen e1 rook against the queen now the simple straight forward threat i will play and uh, you cannot take that that is a problem rook against queen g5 will come so he plays queen a5 going away now queen a5 queen h4 and very interesting improvement the exchange sacrifice will not work now now the c2 point is guarded There is some improvement. I analyzed yesterday. Yeah, mm -hmm. King G8. He played King mm -hmm. King G8. K Knight B3. Mm -hmm. This was a draw, but White should have won the game. This became a draw and substantial improvement. Don't have to do this here. He can attack. Continue to attack. I think somewhere I showed improvement in the game. Uh, this game here. If I is good here. If I where is the move? Here. If I was good move. This is a good move. In the G4, you don't have to take mechanically this. No, in that game, he did not take that pawn. He played bishop into pawn. He played bishop takes pawn instead of taking. This lost quickly after pawn in. This lost. But even if you take that, still there is an improvement. I I have kept it. Where did I bring it? Bring it here. Sir. You have to accept it. Now, instead of that, B5, I found some improvement. Give me, give me one minute and find out. There's only one game, but uh, there is some other game. This is not the authentic game because 
he did not play mechanically uh, the sacrifice okay i will see uh, this diagram i will check again so there has been improvement that rookie 8 improvement was there please note that this is a substantial improvement and white found something also further this is a substantial improvement rookie 8 very important here so i will go to the next game next variation first i will go to the variation before c5 f3 d6 Knight of six, knight c three, dragon, Yugoslav attack, f three, now castle, queen d two, now knight c six. Now there is a threat. So bishop c four. But the critical moment here, knight d seven. Variation one today I discuss now. The idea is to bring both the knights. Now knight coming here, knight coming here, and uh, then I will come and collect the bishop. So, N D seven, two to three game, two games I'll show you. First, that Sulkis versus Tibiako. Tibiako is supposed to be a very strong expert in this dragon. I would say he was authority in the world on Sicilian dragon. Even when Anand Kasparov match was done, Kasparov called him to discuss. the dragon system details so this is knight preparing to play knight to a5 and collect one of the bishop normally bishop comes rook comes so is avoid in that time it is necessary the other alternative now there is a threat here to come and take the bishop so this they this they used to play queen you have stopped the move but the attack the the thread of attack is gone until and unless you exchange the dark square bishop there is no attack so white's main strategic object here is to after the move he wants to h4 h5 take and exchange the bishop and then the attack comes so when you play when you move like queen to c d3 then there is no attack suppose you play the whole strategy of attack is gone no white claiming still advantage it is very much slow so here here it is an improvement we sub see now i don't have to give if you play i don't have to give the bishop so he comes bishop d7 king b1 queen again a good move now the bishop i mean i am not interfering rooks line against the queen not interfering now i have stopped but a central attack will come that plan of h4 h5 is stopped but a different front has opened up it is bad anyway you cannot stop this move it is anyway come will open up the position any anyway. so desperately is trying to stop the counter play forced now black has lot of weaknesses white has only one double pawn but black has many weaknesses is bad now rook into d6 Knight into d6, bishop e3. Everything is coming. Taking the pawn will lose the thread of attack. So knight is belonging to d5. On knight d5, he will control the entire board. So instead of winning a pawn after rook c6 or come back, he will end up only exchanging material. So correct move strategically.
and black pieces is going back and attack is coming anyhow very well played by grand master sulkis sulkis is from lithuania what is the question hello kriya parma defend f7 now the knight is paralyzed knight cannot move on account of knight to c7 now knight e7 is losing to knight knight coming unexpected sicilian dragon now this is finished so you cannot you play cannot play knight e7 you cannot play knight e5 this is again attack is coming okay so this is not a good position already knight is better what are you do structure is better this position and center okay a4 plus now white has got uh, two extra pawn one extra pawn and a dominating knight so black is passive so this is a substantial improvement in the game sulkis played a bg here when you play knight coming to d7 castle and bishop g5 a very important improvement okay so next game belevski played a very beautiful game with kuprichi in his style Now even the bishops are gone, the white has got still attack. White still has attack because black is still underdeveloped. Now it underdeveloped, so white still has attack. Now what are you going to do? This is attack will come, but weaknesses. There are three pawn islands and lot of weak squares. Anyway, the edge line is there, so this may be more tougher. for attack but positional it is very bad so here you place this pawn in two now i think you know this is a position the, the point is unprotected piece that means i can come here and hit and then give a check a very important improvement now taking advantage he comes here are he comes comes over here no what did he do here he played knight first and now rook idea idea rook into and then knight check queen and if he will move somewhere then queen enters to h6 if he will move the queen h6 is coming you go to b5 b6 the queen will enter so rook into g7 is a serious threat so he plays pawn in with the idea that uh, there is some rook check and double so he comes rook into check So here now the position should win because after all the queen is having a black has so many weaknesses. This should win the game. This should win easily winning because uh, king is still weak and the b pawn is still alive. It should win. So the whole point is the queen b six was bad, but anyway. Anyway, there is no position. If you, even if we find here, queen b six, where is the move? Rook has rook double. The position is anyway white better. Suppose you don't play queen b six, what else you will do? I feel that anyway the attack will continue. Queen b six made it very easy. <coughs> After the move, he got a plan quickly, and winning the 
Now you try to improve the queen. Suppose you try to improve the queen. Now I will play rook into any way rook into. The attack is coming. Okay. So the attack is coming and so the, the whole idea that <coughs> coming queen uh, knight so many moves these are bad ideas. These are bad moves to play. Knight d7. This is bad. Knight d7, knight d6 and knight a4. These are bad moves. Hello, Sritu Nandi, welcome. Next, I will go to another variation. So, let us see. Don't worry about nd7, it is just a bad line. Here, nd7, here. Either this is okay, but this is better, even modern. Here, nd7, F3 castle, now queen d2, nc6. Now, bishop c4. So, this is the standard move. The plan black's main line is play bishop d7. Followed by rook c. After bd7, he will play h4. Now, I will play rook c, rook c8 or h5. But what happens if he will not play uh, bd7? Uh, now, in this question, he plays uh, maybe you know, bd7, then h4, and he plays knight into d4. Knight into d4. What happens in that? Okay. Let me discuss. No, oh, I think I have gone some wrong move order. Just a minute. So, queen d2 here, knight into d4. Yeah, this is what I was talking about, d4. So, four or five games I kept. Black wants to play a5, f4. The main plan of uh, capture is, he wants to play a5, f4. And if you take some measure here, or these are all weakening the king, you want to castle and attack. So the plan is designed that the idea is to trap the bishop, but actually he wants to attack the black white king. So now you are at a crossroad. Now if you play ba4, then you are left with a weak pawn. I mean black is left with a pawn weakness, this weakness. So I will play now, maybe I will keep the knight, I will play bishop takes. The good knight still controlling center. Bishop into bishop is bad. Rook into and then I will keep on attacking by a seven pawn. So, so ba4 is not good, he maintains the pawn. This is bad. The idea, now knight in front of the weak pawn. This, Knight will be very nicely placed. I, I watched Grandmaster Vasuko many games. He always liked knight in front of a weak pawn. Isolated queen pawn or a weak pawn. The other pieces cannot attack. Pawn cannot attack. He liked very much knight sitting in front of a weak pawn. So, very good idea. Fantastic. So the pawn is blocked and a target and uh, knight is doing a job. Knight blocked is the best block. Naturally, king is weak and position is plus minus. Now the queen side is settled. Now this bishop is doing nothing. At the moment, the knight is doing point control and this bishop is still watching. The king in danger still. Still the king in danger. And there is no counter attack.
exchanging will give a backward pawn after bishop takes bishop or knight takes a backward pawn i all set now there is nothing unprotected so only white has to watch the back rank that's all white should always be careful about the back rank there is no other problem threat i think black is now having a passive position and no attack because knight the, there is no file for the rook the knight is wonderfully placed controlling everything you have to stop stop that defend back rank is cleared now and now why do you have free hand the threat is now rook here the rook here is a threat oh no 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 because you will give to if you take take queen check and then uh rook check then queen c8 can come not really that is not a threat because the queen will return two rooks so this is not a threat i must say that just keep it i will not i will delete this is not a threat just a minute so here it comes here maybe this simply knight coming to attack knight coming and there it so now the position is bad nothing is moving properly the, the reason is now at the moment i cannot give this because there is a, at the end there is a defense suppose you move the queen then i will play rook h8 maybe knight d3 maybe so he gives a piece but it is not going to work and white went on to win there is no defense queen at the six rook eight mate khatam the extra piece will tell the pawns cannot move forward the king is weak the check is guarded nothing one check only there is only one or two checks and kramni went on to beat so now let's see bolo one you cannot trap there is a threat you want to trap here that there is a threat so you have no time so look at that now if you move the rook suppose you move the rook then i will play it it will make a room for my bishop so you have no time so he plays in the game e5 the idea now if you take he will play pawn into this is coming in a row coming in a row so he is not worried about bishop takes rook but on this idea i want to take attack the rook intermediary move queen into is not possible mate queen takes there is knight is on mate and knight into knight bishop comes back exchange up so very finely played exchange up just exchange up of course uh, this will give counter play if you play this will give counter play that a3 will come Queen into B2 will come. Counter attack will come. Now the position is bad. There is only one lone queen cannot attack. There is no rejoinder. Only lone queen. Back rank. 
एंड विनिंग स्लोली सब पीछे पीछे जाएगा प्लस ओके एंड बोलो वन वन तो आई विल लीव नेक्स्ट गेम so in this game that knight into d4 it is not a good idea this b5 this variation stop almost practically stop now i we already saw this does not work bishop d5 is coming a3 bishop a2 coming so it desperately played now the white plan of attack should prepare for this break now the bishop has room already so eventually we will prepare or get rid of these two pieces so what else you will do here the king is uncastled so you cannot do any attack so there is black has not any appropriate plan so you can see six e6 pawn it is unwise tempting and bad is to go for material this will give sufficient counter play so it is very weak move to go after material in such position so again correctly play now black king is much more weaker compared to it better attack will come white has the attack you cannot take and pushing is also bad if you play push there is nothing and you can't take the material so it is already a bad position i go to the next game stop immediate now b5 we saw We saw b5 is not dangerous, so he plays a5. No problem. Even technically, this also is plus. Like Fisher Larson, you know, after knight into knight, pawn into will get a better one. Now you know bishop into, and white stands better any backward pawn. But technically plus. so you can do that but in the actual game you played here now why this move the point is now if you castle you cannot attack for example you castle now in order to attack you have to play g4 but then this becomes a target this becomes a problem when you play g4 h4 then he will play e5 And then make it a backward pawn. That is that is what happened in one game. Black was grandmaster Tony Miles, and he had an advantage. So he better to play castle short now. Now he will try to exploit the pawn weakness. Now this is a this is a weak square. A knight can always come here, and now this square, this pawn, this pawn. You know all these things will all these things will. have an impact if a player wants to know more better about it how to exploit this structure he should see the game white abar back black lapse abar back versus lapse so king h4 normally a check is there but he goes king h4 good move what else you will do i i cannot get i cannot show something that he will play this place better now white rook has mobility white rook can come here here and you know this square the king is still vulnerable so grand master kinderman went on to beat i am jugger plus okay so technically is bad next game one more game i will show in this series 
Attack is done. You have to defend the pawn. You can't give that. Now white has continued. The kingside attack is there. I don't see. I don't see. You cannot. You cannot accept that. It will lead to mate. Oh. So, in C5 also will lose to check and winning. Idea queen has checked mate. Not mate, winning. This also wins. Also winning. So, in C5 does not work. Even in 74 does not work. He plays in the game 90. It looks funny to castle, but you need to bring the rook into the game. Now, if you play something like rook h2 and come in, the king is bad. You can bring the rook like this, but the king is very openly played. So, he just castles. Only move. Black is white is better. It is a queen. It is just entered. It is. It is very badly placed, and now the bishops are also good. You can't do anything apart from the bishop can come here sometimes, which is also possible. Forced, and the game is lost because queen check. After you take, so. I will see that game. I am only showing the method of playing. I am not showing the latest theory. I am only showing you the type of variations and problems for black. Okay, Virabhadra. All right, I will see this game also. I will see this game. I have got short Kalipman game with me. I have got short Kalipman that Rajdavo and Karyakin Rajdavo I will show. Let's see. So, in this, this variation, I have already discussed that ending to d4 is not good because after this move, you have got counter. -play. So, this type of variation I give, I go for the third move and d4. Now, bd7 here, instead of this, direct nd4. Now, if we place nd4 and bishop e6. Bishop pieces. This is also not good. I have not kept it. Huh? <coughs> I thought I kept it. So, well, wait a minute. I have got this game. I remember. Wait a minute. I have got it here. This is the game. This after Bishop C4. This position is bad. Now there is no attack. Normally the white bishop plays a role. Black's white square bishop plays a role. But here the pawn is bad and I am not weakened. Suppose if I had played g4, some counterplay was there. No counterplay. The end game is bad. And I selected the game because very nicely Shiro had improved technical plus minus. Force rather. 
every square by square he plays good how long you will wait there now black, white plan is to improve next job he will play some c4 move next a4 move a5 move so bring the rook so after that he will bring rook so he will keep on improving the game c4 a4 a5 now a4 no b5 now a5 stopping enemy 6 but c4 so a grip now white has kind of grip on the position you cannot play b5 or b6 that is bad because a pawn will win problem second front is open now black lost patience but it is anyway bad this is collapse the position is collapsing after this the fresh, i will tell you now when a player is defending should not create fresh weakness he should have played maybe maybe here pawn to h6 idea idea if you play i will play g5 or you play i will play h5 so it is passive but it is better to wait the knight is watching this knight is doing a defense of watching watching the squares so you don't need to worry but he lost patience now new target is come. new target the problem there is no time to take you, you cannot allow me capture you cannot push the pawn so pawn into pawn is not working pawn into pawn now knight into pawn and now rook check is coming and knight into pawn is also threatened so the rook check is killing you can't take knight into pawn so you have to now play pawn push is bad you cannot take the pawn anyway now rook d7 check will come so pushes now everything is next he will consolidate he will bring the king here and push the pawn and after that everything is fantastic okay directly pushes so that rook enters the rook enters next job king will come you know the, the consolidation is complete now black pieces are almost paralyzed no file nothing no counter play So that is what I have done before H6. Now break will come. Eventually a break will come. So he won the game. So what transpires that this move ND4 it is passive move. Idea B6. ND4 and BD4. This is having no passive, no activity. One sided. Next I will go. A move like queen b8. So here, queen d2. So I recommend here to play h4. Of course, you castle and come everything. Now the point is, black has to clarify. Black need to clarify. Are you going to allow me, or if you want to stop h5, you play either h5 or rook c8. This is a commitment. Or knight e5 and rook c8. Idea is same. Knight e5, bishop comes, rook c8. But there is important difference because on rook c8, I can move bishop and then knight e5. This is one. The modern move. If you play knight here, I am not going to play rook c8. Ah, uh, bishop. I will play bishop. Why this move? Because I am keeping the square vacant for my knight. In case you come, I will give a knight. Will give a kick. That means there is no attack without bringing queen, without bringing pawn push. There is no attack. 
so if you play immediate knight e5 i will play bishop b2 i'll show you again so that is why knight e5 is bad because i will come back at keep the square b3 for my knight so he plays rook and if you play h5 this is the black attack is slow temporarily of stop temporarily of stop i will show that uh, carpo lebron discussed comment later first let us see rook c this mm -hmm. is the most complicated now castle now bishop g5 so this is started with uh, carpo and sosong anatoly carpo had a smashing victory and many people followed that path carpo sosong this is the model game now here rook c5 why this move because in you you your idea rook and queen against this so you want to get this break idea is to you need to get the break so f4 directly it is not good it turned out bad in the game lubuzovic miles i think this is the problem and it is turned out to bad lubuzovic miles black stood better now you will capture the queen is attack and queen moves you rook into that now queen is going with a check this is coming with a check so no time to do any trick so after pawn into another knight is coming that is why before playing f4 why it would like to exploit this possibility here is queen and rook against this so this should come but not immediate f4 so counter play that is why before playing rook here perfect timing now f4 and now e5 Bishop M Knight. If he takes with the rook, if he takes with the rook, e5 will win the game. E5 will win. Now, now if you play pawn into pawn, you will simply lose the material. I think simply, simply loses material. Maybe here pawn into pawn, knight b5, you will win material. So you have to play move like a counter attack, but. on into idea into 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 of course after pawn into the bishop is trapped but it doesn't matter winning to win the game now rook and queen both attack it's all over okay so this is the problem here in the game to so carpo bit sasonko so this becomes a line for a long time but then <coughs> i will show some games this is very slow black plan is very slow the reason is here normally white gives a pawn sack normally white gives h4 h5 so black has free hand to exchange so here he cannot do any such thing because exchange sack will not get anything so he is going slowly knight f5 the idea there is no immediate attack but it is an investment to open the g5 the position he cannot improve already this is dangerous simple i want to bring a rook and come here and double this is one simple plan second the backward pawn and third there is no attack uh, by black on the white pawn the bishop has paralyzed this has no square so no good activity by black and the g file and this is also a target 
तो जी फाइव इज अ टारगेट सॉरी आई एम मेकिंग रॉन्ग ग्राफ जी फाइव इज अ टारगेट दिस विल नॉट स्टॉप दैट एट यू टू मूव ओनली मूव Now bring in the reserve force. Bring in the reserve into the attack. Once the night comes, that all you will not get that also. So now or never. Better. So he comes. This time he makes improvement on him. Into. So only move, only move, and winning the attacking. And attack comes. So it was slow, but you can see that whole position black becomes totally slow after the move h5. Please note that after the move h5, this becomes a very easy play. After the move h5, it it becomes very slow. I mean, black attack is too slow, and white can play leisurely. Prepare kb1 and g4 very leisurely. Now, Beliavski versus Lubuzovic. So this is old game. It is a good model game. The idea is to play. F4 and E5. Night, uh, night is coming anyway. Making room for. Just open. So here, white has an attack. White played this bad move. At the moment, this is correct to open further. So this is a, not a natural. It is a move playing without calculation. General move to open the h5. Whereas f4, he had a good position. G f4 and queen f4 with active position. This is much better, but he played the bad move. Uh, general thinking to open H line. It is bad. Now he had he had the move. No king G seven, I think. King G seven. Okay. In the game, he missed certain things. So here. What else? The knight will join him now. The knight coming and choking him. So he plays knight. In this point, what grandmaster? Who is that one? Annotator Dulugi. Dulugi says queen b6 was very. Good. That there is a threat coming. So you are only move to defend. Then here is place at five. The bishop joins. The whole point. Anyway, it is a heat of the battle. You know, tense on time trouble, so he missed this move. He played this, and he never got a second chance. Never got second. Rook check and mate. Rook into. Now rook into bishop is also there is a two threat. This is a threat, and this is a threat. The only move. Only move. Now the material up should win that. There is no attack. There is no attack. This is natural looking move is bad. After the move, I will uh, finish the attack. Now only move queen, and then queen takes pawn. So forced. If you play rook into pawn check, the back rank is weak. Suppose you play rook takes pawn here, yeah, the back rank is weak. The idea queen check and rook takes eight check. Queen check, queen takes eight, rook takes eight check. 
you will not be able to handle neither can you play rook h8 check so this is not working so in this case you have to play only queen f8 but then mate threat only mate threat the same variation now queen g7 is losing losing to queen e8 check so only move and you will you must lose the queen now rook h8 is coming on this queen d7 and queen h7 mate since he cannot play rook h8 and now moves the king mate so it turned out to be bad but he missed some move i mean belyavsky he played the move h6 was bad though he won managed to win so this is the most complicated line after any five bg5 started with arpo this is unfortunately going backward gives no threat right going away is not good. this is all in on uh, emotional or instinct not working black pieces are not sufficiently active even a move like knight e knight e2 was also good queen coming back good so you just place this attack white has attack So G5 possible. Only move other. Other moves are bad. If G4, E6 is crossing. Post. Unable to defend. Now whatever you do, it is lost. If you play Queen G5, also losing and winning the game. so the attack or end game either way it is lost so it turns out badly after the move bg5 this move is simply ruled out knight h7 it is just bad move. this kind of move is just bad take take and simply better so on the key move bg5 rook c5 this is the main line now after the move sometimes the players play re8 also at cert certain time so white continues the attack g4 open if you play other move it is bad see nd4 taking the pawn will lose material you will lose material knight into knight and bishop f6 So only move. Pawn into you know here this is not great because you will also pick up the bishop. Pawn into and the bishop is lost. So good move. And winning. Anyway, it is a bad position only. This is winning. So, if you play G3, uh, counter attack pass pawn, the G3 pawn is lost. So you can't play G3. Now, if you play Knight H5, then Queen coming and uh, threat on D6, E7, everything. Now I can give a threat here, and also putting pressure here. So this is also paralyzed. In the game, he plays blunder. We need to end it. Lost. So there, there are two lines here. This is one line, and uh, Haru Kawanato, great coach. So this, this line, you see, I will show you position with H5 and position with N C4 or Rook C5 and Rook E8. So that I am just checking B G5 here. Against Lee Kwa Lim, good move. Now good move. 
So your knight has to go back. But then h5 will come. Knight as king cannot take it. So this is bad. After this, now you don't have time for e6. Next I will clear my rook. Now you move the queen and I will clear the rook. So you place, okay. This is all over. Mating attack will come. So here, the mating attack will come. In this position, this position is gone only. Anyway. So here, I think this was winning. Rook H8. It was found out in analysis later on. Rook H8 only move. And then knight. Idea queen check and mate. Idea queen check and mating attack. So the only, only move. And we, now you take either way, queen is lost. You take knight into, and then again another knight. Same thing, knight into. Or ultimately the queen check and mating attack is coming. Queen check and rook attack. But anyway, he, he did not uh, do that. He, win, he won anyway by playing knight. This also wins. Winning the game. Amanato won another game also, but let me finish variation by variation, one by one. So, here, a recent game. The whole point is here, after the move, knight c4 or b5, a5. There is no other plan. So, knight c4, you take, take. And now there is no threat. I am threatening to play e5. Winning material. Could win. There is no attack. For the exchange, there is no attack. Material and now gradually, one by one, the pieces will start get exchanged. One by one, the pieces will start getting exchanged. Necessary. Queen check will finish. Over. Now everything will get exchanged. Look. And queen h4, queen h5, rd7, things. So this was a modern game and uh, when you see recent games you because they are all working with a team of grandmaster or with engine. So modern games are more preferable in such sharp lines. I think one more game, this one, this one I will show. I will see that game. Dhirabhadra, I will see that game of Rajavo. So, Other move here, bc4 means bishop and knight and e5. And pawn takes pawn, knight b5. This is winning. So, plus minus. So, this is also not good. So, in this position, he plays. This is plus. Okay. I will go for the rook into c4 line now. Bishop takes, rook takes. It is necessary. You cannot take the pawn. Knight into b5 wins. Technically winning the game. Knight into pawn, a3 will come. End game is winning. Killing the game. Okay. So, H5 line I leave. This variation I leave the line. This line is 13, 
in the term H H four H five, there are two choice H five or Rook C eight. In this sense, so I will leave the H five castle Rook C eight, and this is good. So after the move H four, if you don't want to play, you should start your own attack. Rook C eight. So I will discuss Rook C eight. So short Olaf son, short Khalif man. Look into. Otherwise, you will. I will just defend. Otherwise, I will defend and no attack. So now immediate. Maybe it is possible to play queen a five and the rook c eight also, but this is also <coughs> depending. It is possible. <coughs> this is the problem. You cannot trap the queen. Now the bishop is spinning, so you have to move. King means I have a move, so you have no time to play because this is a pawn is spinned. You otherwise this would have trapped the queen, but lucky the bishop is alive still. I think winning winning position. Now Nigel shot one easily because it's a attack, and if you play, then the queen still watching the g6 pawn. No problem. It should win. The black king is in trouble. Now bishop e8 will lose to pawn into and knight coming and queen into pawn and mating attack. Take check check then finishing the game bad. So bishop e8 doesn't work. In the game we played pawn in check check again check. Now you have to join the rook only. Since now this important thing, I must drive the queen. The rook is coming here. So active position of queen must not be allowed. No drive. Winning. Now I will take with check. If you take the with knight, check and check. Otherwise there is a mad threat. So only move. Technically lost. Check, but it is technically winning. Four versus three and one pawn. I have got two one majority. Even with same pawn, I will win. Once this is gone, the pawns are too much. Should win. The end game is hopeless. You can't play rook in rook g7 check is there. You cannot pin it also because rook check and I will release the release the rook check and I will check. So you cannot do that. So here pawn push winning slow. Two pass pawns connected pawns. So short Khalif pawn is all because Khalif pawn. Also a dragon player. Time to time, he adopts dragon, and as a great player, so the theoretically also important, a very important encounter. Now attack. Both will try to attack each other. So this is the idea of R8. He will save the bishop. With the threat of e5, idea to double the rooks, <coughs> desperation.
very well played excellent move e5 is a immediate queen has to the queen c3 and he will defend h8 square after rook into pawn he can defend so so here immediately e5 blocks that now queen c3 will not defend finish idea queen h6 and mate what is wrong just a minute eh? queen h6 the queen exchange will take place check will come so winning हेलो हाँ अभी मैं क्लास में आधा घंटा में फोन करता हूँ तो हियर बाय नाउ रुक इन टू नाइट थ्रेड रुक इन टू बिश ऑफ थ्रेड Threat rook into check and for a important tempo, very important tempo. So the only move, but then pawn in. Again, you cannot play knight in rook seven into pawn. The threat is coming. Idea you take it, it will lead to mate. Rook into check and uh, rook into rook seven into mate. So the important improvement in the variation knight coming lovely. Move. Only move, not pawn into pawn. Only move. Pawn into will lose any. If you play queen takes pawn, the queen has five, the queen has four will attack. So you place knight here. Win. Only move. You can't take the knight. Queen check will win material. Queen bishop into will win material. Win material. Queen check. If king moves, rook check. If queen comes anywhere, rook check, check, check. Meaning, so you cannot take that queen. I mean knight. So here he plays sub, but then rook check. Finish. Check, check. Now finish. So this was a very important game. Very well played by Nigel Sol. Nigel Sort was good in attack. He was very good in attack. So in this variation, this also turned out. I I recommended that uh, opening here. All this has been tried. So here I like the move if this is the move. You know if otherwise the attack comes. If you if you don't play if I uh, if you play immediately queen has to queen c3 there is no attack. He will suffer defend. There is no attack. so it was important thing to close the diagonal defender ka diagonal hi band karo so very well played okay so uh, another thing also you see the rook e8 move now the rook e8 move very important saving the bishop amanato versus rodrigo Manato versus Rodrigo in the Mumbai Mayor Cup last year. Last year in Mumbai Mayor Cup. So now the king has not castled. The impact of exchange sacrifice does not work. Normally they hear some. Now there is no. It is not working. the point the pin very well played by farooq idea you have no time either rook you cannot take you cannot allow me queen h7 check ha huh? which or rook you take lost you cannot allow me only move. but then rook in now beautifully played Check. 
you cannot go to h8 the only move once again the same thread the entire and the c4 the a4 a4 moves coming now the pawn a4 coming so you better move the queen then he will wipe out all side so he comes here it's a blunder it's a blunder the check and then push you know what you are tricking now a4 is a blunder if you better be careful eh Mr. gm rodrigo is very very tricky a4 what he had in mind rook check rook check ulta ulta ho jayega ye aayega to check aa jayega aur ye aayega to queen check aa jayega eh ye check aa jayega so you cannot play mechanically a4 ko from out of the blue ye check aa jayega hai eh? rodrigo ka trick hai but farooq is a smart man so he played the simple move queen check idea now there is no queen b6 check next if he moves now now bishop here he has no check check is not coming gone there yeah. because queen into pawn he has this check geometry queen takes pawn not possible Yeah, please. But it is easy in the heat. Now a player will play quickly, quickly play this, and quickly will resign after the check. So let me show one game: Yuda Sin versus Kogan. All type of moves I will showing you. You know, Yuda Sin. सिन को कहा गया रे तो एच फोर नाउ प्लेइंग एच फाइव और रुक्स एट एंड न्यू नाउ दिस इज स्टैंडर्ड मूव stop the attack or counter attack now a new move this is not going to work now here he plays knight i will now what are you going to where are you going to take the bishop the bishop ko le kahan jayega ye to mar ke aa jayega nahi to kya hoga wo mar ke bishop six abhi leke kahan jayega सेवन पे अटैक है नाइट पे अटैक है ओनली बेटर नाउ ब्लैक हैज लॉट ऑफ पॉन वीकनेसेस व्हाइट हैज अटैक क्वीन बी एट में कोई दम नहीं है बेसिकली वेली मीरो स्टार्टेड इट ग्रांड मास्टर वेली मीरो स्टार्टेड दिस मैन ओवर एच फोर को ये क्वीन बी एट में कोई दम नहीं सिंपल नाइट डी ई टू ओल्ड मूव छोड़ो अभी ये सो ओल्ड मूव में काउंटर प्ले आता था इफ यू प्ले ऑल दिस काउंटर प्ले इज कम सिंपली एन डी ई टू के बाद कुछ भी नहीं नो प्लान ओके तो ये भी छोड़ो नाउ लास्ट प्लान है आरबी चाइनीज ड्रैगन नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू चाइनीज ड्रैगन
ये लास्ट पहलू है आइडिया some b5 and this also so he has got some compensation for the pawn now rook c8 and c4 black has got generated some activity and white has not even started now slow down taking the knight will slow the attack after knight into knight he should forget about that attack bhul jana hai attack kuch nahi milega aage patra kuch bhi nahi mile so you must play knight c4 take take and now kahan se attack aayega you play e5 attack line band ho jayega and this is too slow this is too slow now h file has opened up simply double the rook now you have to simply double the rook rook coming here or here and other rook will come no g4 good move idea if you move the knight queen h8 mate queen h8 mate so moving the knight is bad if you move the knight somewhere then pawn into pawn and again the mate threat will come queen h8 bishop takes rook takes mate so you cannot take pawn knight cannot move you have to take only move idea knight to knight will lead to same mate now a player should not fall into cheap traps <laughs> you know <laughs> there are there is some com bad combination now queen check bishop takes rook check king takes bishop check king here and rook here is winning but what if this combination flaw in the combination here here why should he take the rook this will lose but what <laughs> this is winning the game now if you take the rook it is lost bishop check and rook and stoppable mate bishop king here and it is mate <laughs> but after the rook check he, he need not take this is winning so a player should be careful and responsible conducting the attack reckless attack will not do so here after the move knight into pawn into he plays simple very cool book with the idea next g5 will come so next bishop will come you have to surrender because this is giving a mate in one queen has turned mate you can take because back rank is problem you cannot take with this c8 rook it will lead to mate so only move only move okay sir i have end game now it will it will boil to end game so knight into khatam ho queen exchange and khatam exchange up we karo end game ho kuch nahi exchange up so this is a very important encounter the man who won the goa and bombay so this was the terrace Sakarian is a very good player, so the attack Chinese attack did not do well here. The B5 Chinese attack, there is Rook B8, Rook B8, K B1. My recommendation K B1. 
simply and after the night moon we sub retreat to this side except the path kuch nahi ho so two more games on this side so two more games chinese so chinese attack chinese dragon ko kb1 now he did not give a pawn b5 simply bad we already saw so just come over here now you can even now you can go <coughs> king also why this is the only target point so king here with the idea the rook will defend there is no attacking point there is no target no target for uh, black but let us not play passively the modern grand master always go aggressive <coughs> so this is okay no attack will come with the idea now pawn check picking up a piece khatam there is no attack idea rook into a chance only only move now piece gaya only move khatam so even king b1 so i chinese Chinese dragon direct play to play KB one is enough. After the move, whether you play knight here, now you give directly, it is not working. If you play slowly, it is not working. If you play slow, it is. I will go for a very easy attack. Really, King A one and idea rook A, and there is no attack. So this is one more game Chinese dragon. Chinese. Chinese virus. So after the move rook b8, the regular line is rook c8. Rook b8 is called Chinese. Now complicating, unnecessary. Sida sida mar dena hai idhar. Sida sida mar na. Anyway, attack karna chahta. This is unnecessary tension. अभी भी कुछ नहीं है बट इज प्रिपेरिंग टू हिट रूक इन टू समाइम द क्वीन चेक दिस वन सो नाइट हेज टू हियर ऑल दाइम इफ यू मूव द नाइट समवेयर रूक इन टू नाइट रूक इन टू पॉन कम सो ओनली ये सब जरूरी नहीं था वो जो पहला गेम खेला दैट इज मच इजियर अलेक्स सिंह को दिस इज अनसर कॉम्प्लिकेशन गो वाइट इज बेटर तो it is a too modern game 2017 but you need to calculate whereas in this variation there is no calculation required so in this variation here alex singh ka game mein sidha sidha maar dena hai abhi ye aaya kb1 ko any five then you go bishop aaya abhi bishop sidha maar do usko and maar do isko aage kuch bhi nahi okay so Doubt in the game, Chris John Christian. Twenty-six move. Okay, I will see it. What is this? I will see it. Twenty-six move. So, what is the question? I have a doubt. What is the doubt here? On twenty-sixth move, here he played knight into knight, and now what is the doubt? He comes here. He cannot take. He cannot take mate. If he takes mate in, he will kill. So mate will be. So he will kill. So only move. He only move. Or something? Is there any other move? What if queen is checked? Oh, here. Queen has checked. Bishop takes. Rook takes king. 
another roof checking now there is a threat here no no threat what are you going to do then you want to play what do you do now so here queen h8 ko maar dega now what is uh, what is the position queen h8 you will take it what is the idea kg7 rook h7 b h8 queen h8 b h8 rook h8 kg7 rook h7 so how it works how it will work you have to now bring the rook knight mar raha hai ye mara to bhi kya ho mara to bhi nahi ye to abhi ye hai check diya ab ye mara to bhi mara to nahi hoga mara to nahi mara to hoga uh, knight into no this is knight in. but i will play here rook check i will play king want to give this i'll take it now knight into <coughs> okay abhi let us see aapka abhi kya hai yahan par hai ye to ye maar diya to kya karoge ab ye maar diya to discover check mein kuch nahi ho kya karoge अगर रुक चेक देगा रुक चेक देगा तो किंग आ जाएगा आगे कुछ नहीं यू वॉन्ट गेट तो क्वीन भी देने को तैयार होगा नो अटैक कमिंग ओके सो इट इज नॉट ए गुड आइडिया ट्वेंटी सेवन मूव ओके क्या खेला उसने ई एफ सिक्स तो उसने बिशअप डी फोर खेला तो बिशअप डी फोर के जगह में यू वॉन्ट टू गिव क्वीन चेक क्वीन चेक को मारेगा अभी रुक इन टू मारेगा तो किंग आए रुक सेवन रुक सेवन तो मार देगा अभी मारेगा अभी ये मारेगा तो आई विल हैव क्वीन इन टू पॉन नॉट वर्किंग ओके सो चाइनीज ड्रैगन में कोई दम नहीं है ओके यू टू जस्ट से फॉलो दिस तो एक और वेरिएशन रह गया ओके हो गया सो आई आई गेव एन ए रफली पॉसिबल लाइन्स ऑन सिसिलियन ड्रैगन वाइट साइड एंड माई रिकमेंडेशन is to play simple now e4 c5 knight f3 d6 d4 should be and e4 now g6 now bishop e3 bg7 f3 castle queen d2 in c6 now you i recommend castle no i recommend h4 here the right branch either now No, no, sorry. I bishop c4. I am also tired. Bishop c4. Now bishop d7, h4. So here there are two branches. Either he can play h5 or he will bring the rook. Because queen b8. Simply I told you knight will come and now there is nothing. This is an important improvement. Black has no plan. And if you play right now knight here, if you play h4. and now you play knight here i will now play bishop to e2 so that your queen a5 is bad now after knight b3 will come no attack there is no attack so there are only two plan either you play h5 or you play rook c8 if you play h5 then your attack white blocks attack is slow so this is good position and if you play rook c8 i discussed all possibilities okay so my friends i will discuss next is nasdor 
द मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट सिसिली तो मे बी मे बी आई विल टेक ए ब्रेक टुमारो आई थिंक आई विल नीड टू आई नीड टू प्रिपेयर माई सेल्फ लुक बिकॉज देर आर सो मेनी मॉडर्न डेवलपमेंट सो टुमारो आई विल नॉट टेक नजर आई विल हैव ए लुक अबाउट डे आफ्टर टुमारो आई विल शो यू एंड टुमारो आई विल गो टू सम मिडिल गेम पोजिशन डिस्कशन ऑफ मिडिल गेम्स planning and weaknesses middle game so I, today it is uh, thursday that means i will show friend saturday saturday we will see nagra okay so thank you very much being with me see you back tomorrow morning 9:30 for the next class tab tak sabko mana namaskar take care bye